Tourism to St. Marie, we're very excited to bring back for the second year the Poker Run event. Uh, we had a successful year in 2016. We attracted for the first time event 20 boats from all over Ontario and Michigan. And by all tale, uh, everybody had a fantastic time. They said it was one of the best poker runs they've ever attended. So that really gave us inspiration to bring it back for a second year. And it, as you can appreciate, it takes a lot of planning and, uh, and working through, but uh, we're hoping to double the size of the event this year. So somewhere between 30 and 40 boats, which will really fill up the marina down here and fill up the waterfront. And uh, it's, a, it's a full weekend, uh, full exciting events. So from August the 4th to the 6th, um, starting on the Friday evening down here at the Bondar Pavilion, we'll have the community night. So we have the Bondar Pavilion set aside for the Friday evening. Uh, we're going to have live entertainment, we're going to have a beer garden, there's going to be some exhibits and displays, and just a lot of fun. But the big part is we're going to have all the boat owners and operators and their boats right down here on the waterfront. So some will be in the marina right adjacent to the Bondar Pavilion that people can go and look at. But for the first time this year, we're going to block off Foster Drive and we're going to have a number of the boats on their trailers uh, sitting along Foster Drive where the community can come out and see the boats up close, get their pictures taken with them. And these are great boats. I mean, they're upwards of 50, 54 foot offshore power boats. And it's something we don't get to see every day. So that's the Friday evening. Then Saturday is the actual poker run itself. And that's where the owners of the boats and it's why they come here to do this. They actually go out and do a poker run to pick up five cards. And then they have a dinner at the end of the evening and the, and the team with the best five cards wins the prize. So the opening ceremonies will start at 9.30 here at uh, the Bondar Marina. Uh, at 10 o'clock uh, they will be doing their parade of power which is they'll just all the boats will cruise out onto the waterfront so anybody that comes along uh, by the Bondar or in front of the Delta will be able to see it firsthand. And then they will all take off with the official start at 10.30 and head down river. So the course is similar to last year. The boaters love the course, so they'll head out down, uh, down the river, uh, head towards St. Joseph Island. Their first stop will be Richard's Landing. They'll pick up a card there. They'll carry on to Hilton Beach, where they will actually stop, get gas, have lunch. They'll get out of their boat, so they'll be in the marina uh, where they pick up a card there. And what's good is that's Hilton Beach's community night weekend as well. So there'll be a lot of activities and people down on the waterfront. So once they pick up their card at Hilton, they'll get out into the open water, which is what they really enjoy in the North Channel, where they can really crank it open and you know, go in triple digit mile per hour. And uh, they'll head directly over to Thessalon, where they'll pick up another card. And again, perfectly, it's Thessalon's Community Day weekend as well. So the waterfront should be full of people. And they'll just uh, turn around then and start heading back towards Sault Ste. Marie, where they'll pick up their final card um, right here at Bondar. And that'll be the, the day uh, they have a dinner for, for the boat owners to where they, you know, they pick the winner. The next day, and again, I, I revert back to a community event, is uh, from about 10 a.m. till 4 p.m. we'll have uh, charity rides. So we get a lot of the boat owners that stay around for that extra day. And uh, the community can come down and purchase a ticket to ride on one of these great boats and all of the money goes to charity. In this case, it's Big Brothers Big Sisters of Sault Ste. Marie. Uh, they were a great partner last year and we have them back this year uh, who organized those, uh, those rides. So uh, that takes place all of Sunday. And again, you know, last year, I think we raised almost $10,000 for charity, so which is great and everybody has a fun day. The community can come down, ride in the boats and, and it's all for a good cause. So that's, uh, that's the weekend in a bit of a nutshell. It's uh, going to be exciting. It's going to be bigger and better and we're, you know, we're very pleased that as Tourism Sault Ste. Marie, we were able to you know, start this event last year and hopefully continue to grow it year in and year out so it becomes an annual event on our waterfront. It's a unique event for Sault Ste. Marie, but it's perfect. We're a waterfront community, so why not use our water, waterfront to our best ability? We have a website developed, uh, it's suepokerrun.com. Just visit it there and it's got all of the details and the information about the event. And, or they can call our office, Megan Parlow, uh, is helping coordinate the event from Tourism Sault Ste. Marie. Her phone number is 705-759-5442. Uh, and that's just if you want information. Or we're looking for volunteers uh, in terms of boats maybe out to be marshal boats out in the water to hold flags and things. If anybody's interested in that, they can contact Megan and she'll uh, hook you up.